Hey there Titans, and welcome back to another Titan Academy video. Today we're going to be talking about the where used function in Titan Web. So if we head over to our Salesforce integration, and we're going to focus on push for today because we're in our series about pushes, but this also goes for gets as well. You can find the same feature in gets. Let's take a look at our pushes. We have a number of pushes on this project, and sometimes it might be a little bit tricky to remember where exactly you've associated this integration. Is it on a button? Is it being caused by some condition? What exactly is triggering this integration? And so we have a nice little feature that will help you check that out. So if you look in any of your push integrations here, you'll have a option for where used. And here you have, as you can see, the page where the action is and the actual action itself, action number two from this page. And we actually have a shortcut to the action just like that. All right, so we'll take you directly to the action. We can see this is our rule two, and that's why here it tells us this is action two. And if we go to our other push, of course, we'll see the same here as well under the create contact form in the add contact action one, we have this option. So again, we can of course now navigate to those pages and find exactly where the action, in this case, it's on the add contact, like we said, but that will help you find exactly where your integrations are set up. So a super useful feature can help you for a lot of debugging and just organization. If you have a project with many, many integrations, this should simplify things. And that's how it's done.